The hunt is on. All right, let's play some fucking Kaisa. I really need to get a Kaisa YouTube video. Okay, it's probably gonna be Lux support, right? So, I might be able to go Magical Footwear here, honestly. I have a question, if they have three ranged, I go Gale Force, right? Depends. It depends on what the other two characters are. If they're super beefy tanks, then no, you don't. You go Kraken. But if they're if they're mostly squishies, like if they have their mostly squishies, like let's say they're, they're, uh, they're, they have three ranged characters, and then their jungler's like something squishy, kind of like Kha'Zix maybe, Gale Force is still viable. But if they're playing like Viego, you can't really go Gale Force because you need to kill them. We need, we need Ignite fucking Exhaust this thing. It just depends. It's like really situational when you go Gale Force. You have almost no chance of winning a trade. Right, this lane is like, it's just how the lane is is played. Like, you have very little chance of actually beating Gear or fucking Draven in a trade. The thing is, is you just kind of have to forfeit lane, right? And they also took exhaust because they're fucking pussies, right? Basically, we kind of have to forfeit laning face unless our jungler comes and our jungler's fucking Diana. So she's not very good at ganking Draven because Draven can just eat him out of his, uh, is is he? See, this shit is cancer. I'm 20 and one on fucking Kaisa this year, this season with this, and this count, 20 and one. Dude, Draven players are so bad. For some reason, they think they're just invincible, even though we get level two first with Lulu. Uh, another another big thing that could be like losing you games is not using your level two right. Kaiza has one of the best level twos or one of the best level two shoves in the game. Like her level one shove is so good because her Q is an execute or minion execute under 35% health. So you know if you use that to your advantage, it's it's really hard. It's really hard to. It's really hard to lose, like, this. even the Draven, like, you know, you're super scared of Draven typically, right? It's like one of the worst, it, or it's probably the worst Kai'Sa matchup in the game. But if I get level 2 first, even he's, like, not invincible if I have, like, a Lulu or a Shield Champ, you know? So this is going to shove towards us, so we don't want to actively hit the wave, we just want to last hit here. Like this. When I play against Draven, it's troll to go Cole, yeah. It is. See what I'm saying? This guy thinks he's fucking invincible. For some reason, yeah, it's troll to go Cole. You go, uh, you go longsword, triple pot, or Doran's blade. Oh my God, what the fuck is wrong with you? Yeah, I knew their jungler was here. It's so obvious. I think he's dead, maybe. Dude, our jungler is so bad, dude. fucking youtuber <laughs> got our youtube video boys let's fucking go uh this game we go collector we go collector this game we just go the the, the normal collector build we want early q evolve here so we can keep stomping draven we got our youtube video boys we got our youtube video this is 100 percent of youtuber really. this just stomping this draven on me it's kind of crazy the hunt is on That guy thinks uh, he's invincible for some reason because he's playing Draven. Every Draven player thinks they're just Giga Chats no matter what. The guy's 0 2. I have, I'm level 6, he's level 5, and he's trying to walk up to the wave. Dude, a better back is so much better than plates, dude. Plates, guys, don't overvalue plates ever. Okay, this guy is so bad. Oh, damn. Ow! What is he doing? <laughs> if I had flash, I could just kill him, I think. Oh, he trolled this by not just running towards tower. If he just ran towards tower initially, he would have been fine. Yeah, I'm a bad bitch. You can't kill me. 
Uh, this game, uh, you can get, you can go Gale Force if you really want to, but Lulu is way like if you have a Lulu, it's always it's always always worth to go uh, to go fucking Kraken because your DPS output is just disgusting. I cancel some auto. Oops. Guys, just go at her, dude. Doesn't matter who's here. You know how fucking strong I am. Flash my RW, you little bitch. So we're so strong, nobody in the nobody on the map can one be on us. But yeah. I actually like what the Lulu did this game by taking Exhaust Heal instead of Flash. Exhaust. It's actually probably more beneficial for the lane matchup than uh, Flash Exhaust would be. By the way, if anybody's wondering, this is a Smurf account. I'm, I'm in Plat 1D4 right now on this account. This is uh, pretty low E though. I needed a I needed a Kaisa video for my YouTube channels because it's been a little bit, so I just decided to uh, plan a Smurf account because playing Kaisa in Hilo is really bad. She's like super bad at Hilo. Should be a free fight, and she got eat out of her E. Oh. Oh, she made up for it by flashing. <laughs> Why is, why is Kaisa so bad on high elo? People really know how to punish what she what she's like. People really know how to punish her playstyle, essentially. You can't, uh, with Kaisa, Kaisa's landing phase is really bad unless you have a super aggro support champ like Alistar Leona, right? Which is picked quite a bit in, in, Master, in my elo, which is Master's elo, right? Um, the reason she's so bad is because people really know how to punish Kaisa for what she does, right? As well as, um, People in high people in high elo actually pick what's meta, and what's meta right now? Hard counters Kaisa, Vayne, Lucian, Draven, uh, fucking Jinx. All those champs are pretty counter, like, kind of counter Kaisa. That's why she's so bad. It's mainly because of her spot in the meta. The reason she's so good in low elo is because people don't know how to punish those mistakes, and a lot of people just play whatever the fuck they want. They don't play to like they don't play for meta. I can't really overcommit with a Pantheon there. Like I said, Pantheon is... What do you think about the hybrid build for Kaisa? What, the one in my guide, or? Go crack and collect your Nasher's Zanyas. I think it's good. I think it's really solid. You can build it almost every game, but there's better builds for specific games. 